about the power range i'm tk i'm dusty and uh make sure y'all stick around in the video so you get hit in the face with pie and today's episode is sponsored by american tactical pony in shelby north carolina that's right he let me talk that's right he actually stopped and let me talk i'm proud of you you know i do talk a lot and i do talk fast he does he but, does not stop talking but, but today's episode we are going to uh <laughs> shoot some more lesser than lethal stuff at these nice jugs and see if it uh, will go through. Penetrates, goes through, or bounces off. We'll find out. But we'll wait to the end to see TK get pied again. We'll see about that. All right, you ready, Biggin? Oh yeah, let's go. Let's go. I got his favorite favorite pistol. This uh, orange and black one. Shoots rubber balls. He won't let me shoot no uh, mace balls. But we got four of them. Let's see if it'll bust the water jug. TK, let me shoot you in the foot. <laughs> this is empty. We got at least one in there. Oh, there's the. Oh, yeah. There you go, folks. That's what it looks like. Oh, we little... can reuse that one. Yeah. We can reload those easy. Anybody getting in the reload, and this reload rubber balls are real simple. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say, is there anything in there? Oh, there you you caught it. Nah, nice. Got another one. Only one in there? Yeah, only one in there. Yeah, that thing had enough behind it to puncture it, but it sure didn't go through. Next, we're using the uh, Anderson Manufacturing 410 AR. Using the uh, less than lethal, less lethal little rubber balls. Like four, four or so in there. Let's see what happens, shall we? All righty. No good. Mhm. Mm oh. Let's uh. Let's see if it's got enough behind to knock the plate off, you think? I doubt it. If I can hit the plate. Where's my sight? Alright, clear. Same round he's got, but I'm using the governor. At the same distance. At the same distance. And we'll shoot, hopefully hit the orange one. Clear? Like, a, what's that drink? The, the, the bubbles in them? The little balls in the drink? What's them things called? Bubble tea? Bubble, yeah, that's what it looks like. It's trying to come out. I ain't never drunk them. You never drunk a bubble tea before? Yeah, a little rubber balls. Huh, so I had enough to go in there, not come out. There's a couple more over there. Ooh, he caught some. Those things are neat, man. I guarantee you they hurt pretty good. All right, next we're using the Mossberg 590S. And right here is what I call dog scaring rounds. It's a 12 gauge bird shot with the bird shot taken out with the uh, cotton ball in it you know scare dogs or trespassers and we're gonna stick around the same distance because this is a good you know home defense distance my in your house or whatever so dog scaring rounds trespassers scaring rounds let's see what happens all right I'm ready for some snow mm -hmm. hey oh, I nicked it oh look like the upside down over here y'all Clear. Let's 
Nothing but cotton balls, but that cup I think is what did, did most of the damage. There's some of the cotton right there. Back here. That's how we can make our scene from the upside down is shoot a bunch of cotton up in there. Yeah. <laughs> so. I saw it first. KJ was well, emptying the water out. KJ like, there's something in there. I saw it first. So yeah, the cotton I don't think did it, but that cup obviously did it because it was inside the daggum thing. So the cup, that distance, the cup would sting you pretty good, but that cotton would just scare you. <laughs> Shooting a virus ball. <laughs> good catch, TK. <laughs> what oh. the, you gonna shoot a shotgun or anything? I mean, it's the 590S. Wow. If they don't know, you know now. I'm gonna take it off a of safe. Oh, Terminator. <laughs> I'll be back. Here, hang on. Let's get you. Uno, Uno Moss on that yellow one. One more time on the yellow one in case y'all need to turn. Yeah. Clear. Nothing, nada, nada. Well, we gonna look around for a minute, folks, try to find one of the little orange balls, show you. All right, so we couldn't find one, so we're gonna load one in here. Hit the silhouette. I'm gonna hit the, try to hit the silhouette down there and just show y'all what it looks like. Y'all good? Mm-hmm. Yeah, oh, I see it too. He's walking right to it. All right, so Dusty was able to see it. That's what it looks like, y'all. Like a little virus ball. <laughs> and there's your, there's your a go home gift. Here you go, KJ. Thank you. Take it, put it under your pillow, and the gun fairy come back and put it back in the show for you. Will, it, will the will the gun fairy leave me a uh, Benelli under my pillow? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm shooting TK's favorite round today, the Reaper Defense Beehive. He loves bees. He's he's very very into bees. But anyway, yeah, I'll show up. Nine. Nine. Nine has got many many rubber balls. <laughs> nine. Safety off. No. Oh. Dang. And uh, it's clear. Hey, you popped the hole and slid it. Looks like I see something floating around in there. I see one back around the table too. That's that cup, probably. No, no. Oh, man. Hey, there's the cup yeah. that kind of holds them in there. There's all little. Those are soft rubber, too, man. The motor, the orange ones are like hard to push. I'll shoot you one of them. Oh. Uh, there's the one from the 410 a while ago. That's 12 gauge. That's crazy. Springfield XD Elite, 9 millimeter. And we have these. Rat shot, varmint, what did you call them, Dusty? Pest control. Pest control rounds. And we're still a little bit back using that, or we just shot from with the other less lethal stuff. And this would be good for wild animal, scare them off, maybe sting them a little bit, or maybe even a wild trespasser. Am I all right? Everybody good? Yep. Only problem with these things, a lot of times they don't, if you load up a couple of them, they won't cycle. So I only got one. Good? See? Clear? Yeah? You see there? Spread real fast. All right. It only made one hole? No, it made a bunch. Using the FN S40, shooting the same round TK just shot just in a 40 caliber. Oh yeah. 
I had some more. Oh, it cycled that time. There. How about that? Clear? I also got a little bit of leakage back here, too. We can tell anybody. Yeah. <laughs> Is there anything in there? I don't see anything in there. If we do, man, I, there probably is, but it's gonna be so small, we might not be able to see it. But let's just let it pour out fairly slow and see. Pour out where it's dry on the table. No, it's wet. Here, Goober. Oh yeah. Mm. There you go. Little BB like. Ah, I can't get them. BB. Yeah, little BBs. All right, back from pie business. Yeah. Let's take care of some pie business. All right, All right I hope hey, hope y'all hope you uh, enjoyed today's enjoy video. Today's video. Yeah, yeah. And please remember to like, like, comment, comment, subscribe. It means the world to it us. It does. And today's episode was, was sponsored. sponsored by American Tactical Pony in Shelby, North Carolina. That's right. <laughs> and uh, and what? And, and we got anything else to say? No, we're gonna no, leave. We, we, we're gonna wrap it up. Uh, buddy behind the camera gets to see who gets fired. Yeah, TK and I volunteer for yeah. the pepper one too. <laughs> Can you tell me what the bomb that plate says? No, I can't read it right now. It's gonna be slow motion. God, that's worse. Mm. Well, he said, make sure you don't get it on my shirt. Dusty out, TK. Gone. <laughs>